Pending now, Congresswoman Jackie Spears in the middle of a heated public debate with the National Park Service over the controversy of walking dogs off leash on federal parkland. ABC 7 News reporter Cornell Bernard joins us in San Francisco with the story. Cornell. Cheryl, dog owners are so passionate about this, they got Congress involved. Representative Jackie Spear holding a public forum here at Stern Grove. She's looking for canine solutions in our Bay Area National Parks. Jaja. Jan Zakin says letting her dog Jaja off leash at Chrissy Field is a morning ritual. I've run her three to five miles every day and she has to be off leash. She needs to do ten, you know, plus miles or she doesn't get enough exercise. And restricting that access would be a deal breaker for Jan. It would be devastating for us. I mean, I think we'd move. We'd probably go up to St. Lena. Wow. Where dogs can roam on and off leash in the Golden Gate National Recreation Area has been debated for more than a decade. New dog restrictions released by the National Park Service in 2011 caused such an uproar among dog owners. It caused Congresswoman Jackie Spear to get involved, calling this public hearing in San Francisco looking for a solution. Dog owners? Non-dog owners, bird watchers, <coughs> bicyclists, everyone's interests has to be accommodated. But how to do that? Sally Stevens says responsible dog owners should be given an all-access pass to parks. So basically what's happening is the feds are coming in and telling the local people that they can't do the things that they've been doing on their land for 50, 60, 70 years. The dogs dig holes going for gophers, chase birds, you know, run over flora and fauna. Park officials say hopefully there can be room for everyone to enjoy our amazing Golden Gate National Recreation Area. Everybody wants to enjoy the same area, whether you want to do it with a dog or you rather would not have dogs at all. Controversial dog management plan has received more than 4,000 public comments so far. The Park Service will keep that comment period open until February 18th before making a decision. They say, speak now or forever hold your leash. Live in San Francisco, Cornell Bernard, ABC7.